Hey guys, you've probably stumbled upon this video because you're interested in finding out how to broadcast your yoga, pilates, dance class and are not sure how to do it. Well, you've come to the right place. So before the pandemic hit, gyms were packed. Group classes were filled up and people were running in and out of gyms like crazy. However, once the pandemic started and lockdown began, people everywhere started working from home, including working out from home. So what does this tell us about the fitness industry? If you Google online fitness or live streaming classes, you'll find hundreds and hundreds of articles stating the exact same thing. The fitness industry has changed. They're even stating that gyms are prepared to offer, even after the pandemic, online and offline classes to their clients. So this might be a business proposition for you you might be the next best home workout option. And you can do this with WP Stream. If you don't already have a WordPress website, you can go to wordpress.org and either get a hosting provider or download and install it by yourself. It's a pretty straightforward process and there are a lot of videos out there showing you exactly how to do this. Once you've created your account, you can go on and sign in to your website and it'll take you straight to your dashboard. Now, there are different themes for you to use for your website. I currently have the Avada Yoga theme and this is how it looks like. I will list more details on how to get this for your website down below. And these are basically all the graphics that are going to be included on your website if you choose to download Avada Yoga. So if you'll go back to your dashboard and go to plugins because you will need to install the WP Stream plugin. So add a new plugin and look up WP Stream. You can install now. And activate it. Once you've done that, it will automatically be over there. Go back to your dashboard and when you go on the left hand side to WP Stream, click on credentials. And if you don't already have an account, you can create one by clicking the link here. So you will just have to register with your first name, last name, email address and make sure you include a strong password as well. Click on I am not a robot and simply register. This will take you to your accounts page on WP Stream and you'll see your free trial package. So go back to your WordPress and enter the credentials that you've just used to register and save changes you'll be connected to WP Stream and now you can create a channel. So go to WP Stream channels and go to create new free channel right over here. From here, you can add a title for your video, for your live broadcast. This is pretty important because this is what your viewers are going to see. And on the right hand side, you can click on publish. Once you click on that and you wait for a bit, you will find settings. Under settings, make sure you click on record, live, start your live event, and you can go live with external broadcaster and it'll give you a server and stream key. You will enter that into OBS. So OBS Studio is a free professional tool that you can use to broadcast live events using RTMP. I will list the video in the description bar of how to use it and some more explanations. But for now, let's go to settings, stream and enter the server and stream key as seen on WP stream. Just copy to clipboard and paste it like so. Click on OK and you can simply click on start streaming on the right hand side. Once that's done, you can go back to your dashboard and click on view channel. This will take you straight to your live stream and this is how it's going to look like to you and for your audience. 
this is a player on the top left hand corner you will find the number of viewers so to stop it you can go back on OBS and simply click on stop streaming if you go back you'll see that the live stream is paused and may resume shortly now that that's done you can go back to your dashboard and go to WP stream media management this is where your live stream has been recorded and your file is now present you can create a pay-per-view give it a name you can give it a description as well just to explain what it's about and make sure it's a video on demand and give it a price also set a product image so that it looks nice to your viewers and include some tags as well that's always helpful Click on publish and your pay-per-view is live. If you click on the link, it'll take you straight to the product and this is how it looks like. Your viewers can add it to cart and when they view the cart, this is how it looks like. They'll proceed to checkout, enter all their details and continue. They can place their order and to access the video, they will click on the product name. There is a link attached to it and it'll take them straight to the video. Once they press play, this is how it looks like. They can go forward, go backward, pause, play. If they visit your store, they will find a variety of products that they can watch. These are all pay-per-view products. and. If you click on advanced workshop for example they'll see this class they can add it to their cart there's a description they can share it and that's basically it for this video i hope you've enjoyed watching it and make sure you like comment and subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you're announced whenever we release a new video until next time see you soon